Personally, I think the female Alex's voice actor is a little better. And again, I have to apologize that we had to do this. Um, it's partially the game. Invisible War is very buggy when it comes to doing it on a Windows system. It was originally designed for Xbox, so you'd think it'd be better a customer of this kind of thing. But it seems to have like a thing against the male Alex. Cairo International Airport. This small landing pad was the closest I could come to the city center. Why did you expect to find an international airport? According to my map, there should be an airport 22 kilometers northeast of central Cairo. Instead, that seems to be the site of a landfill. There hasn't been commercial air travel since the collapse, 20 years ago. Perhaps my navigation database is out of date. I'm talking about the collapse, the biggest depression in world history. I guess you don't follow current events. Of course I know about the collapse. If I fail to find the passenger I'm looking for, I'll be available to take you to another destination. If so, we'll leave from this landing pad. Okay, so Ava's still going to help us out here. Let's take a look underneath these nice little traits. Let's see what we have here. Okay, since we apparently are much more hurting for material than Alex, male Alex was. <laughs> Female Alex is apparently a little more free with her multi tools. Let's check out here. Uh, there's our pilot beacon. Binoculars we don't really need. Oh, another maintenance receipt for the pilot beacon. Uh, refused a firmware upgrade. Oh, keen! A refused firmware upgrade. That's probably why we were able to land here with no trouble at all. Air traffic must cease immediately. It's a black market one. Or they're trying to find our friend in the helicopter like they were before. Uh, med kit and that. Nah, not worth it. What are these? Buckets. Is there anything on top of there? There is something on top of there. I can't get up there though. Alright. Let's push this over here. And we're full energy cells, so my jumping up and down like an idiot is worthless. Alright. Once again, good work in Seattle. The WTO is making good use of the data. Hello, Your next hello. objective? Destroy the Nassif family's greenhouse, which is in the northwest corner of the South Medina. The experimental greenhouse, a violation of WTO regulations, should lead us to Dr. Nassif. We are looking for Dr. Nassif, but we're also not as stooges the WTO. They have their own reasons for having us go places, and I'd rather not just suck up to whoever they want to do. I haven't seen you before. Welcome to our small Medina. Hi, hello. name's Alex. Pardon the simplicity of this drawing, but I like to give newcomers a map so they can find their way around. The local business owners are always complaining that they don't get enough foot traffic. Thanks, that's very thoughtful. In my experience, people are a little more helpful towards the female Alex too, which is another reason I like playing her, but... Yeah, same basic information. There's our map of the Medina. Wow, he's got pretty good handwriting for a guy who doesn't usually speak English. Bread. Behaving like a fool. No, I'm just stealing your bread. Is there more bread back there? Ah, uh, no, it's... Oh, crap, you're the coffee dude, aren't you? Yeah, you're a quick place guy. Well, someone new in the Medina. Don't worry about catching the plague at my little coffee stand. We are a high-priority zone for the bots. And we it upsets me that he has to say that at all, but... That's good to hear. People come to the old city to find the black market. Is that why you risk getting infected? Security must be pretty non-existent around here. Is there a lot of crime? Not my concern. There is always strife. I ask because I can make a deal for someone who could get into the new Cairo Arcology and do Queequegs a favor. I'm listening. The regional director has been disappointed in my profits since the intensification of Nanite Swell 11. I lose the shop if I can't find a way to impress him. What am I supposed to do? NG Residence is playing a concert in the Arcology. NG's support. here, good. I need someone to convince her to endorse Queequeg. I have a free ticket for her, her. even on this particular game. Her manager, Withers, can easily be brought. Try to catch her waiting for NG and offer her some money. If she accepts, I will compensate you with a choice of several weapon mods, which I found on a dead Omar. Yeah, it just Miss happened Withers, to be dead Omar. I'll let you know if I run into her. Was he alive Omar when you found him originally? No, I don't I care. Stand back, SSC on duty. Okay. I'm not gonna mess with you like I missed the Queen Sophia, so. Just taking a break. Break. I'm going to be taking your med kit. I need more than you do. We'll try to overlook your betrayal at the Mako facility oh, if you help us find Dr. Nassif. She comes from a poor family in this plague stricken village. Billy Adams will be coordinating the investigation from the mosque that lies between the oncology and the village. Report to her at once. It's our best friend Billy. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to look around here a little bit more before we have to run off because I don't want to have to end the. do another super duper short one. 
here's a checkpoint for the archaeology. Come work in the archaeology. Fusing architecture and ecology, these WTO constructed cities provide easy pedestrian access to all work, living, and recreational spaces inside the, the, the. It's an enclave, basically, like we saw in Seattle. And you have soda. That's my soda. And you have Excuse me. I'm not supposed to allow that sort of thing. And you just did. I have to see your archaeology pass before I can let you in. I don't have one. How do I get one? If you don't already have one, then you're probably not supposed to have one. But there might be a compromise. Such as? There are those in the Medina who might get you a pass for a price, but really all they're looking for are mercenaries to do their dirty work. Me? I just want to help people out. Give me a few credits <laughs> for my trouble and I'll act like you've got a pass. Wow, she was a lot of credits. I'll no thanks. I'll find another way to get in. It's uh, in here. Uh, two concussion. You're guarding two concussion grenades behind a lock. That good? It's just a waste. Oh, plenty of seating. All right. Uh, let's go this way. This will lead us to the greenhouse, which is where the WTO wants us to go. Oh. Uh, this looks like an ambush. I've tried again and again to get accepted into the archaeology. Definitely an ambush. We're sick of you archaeology types coming out here, pointing and laughing like this is a theme park or a zoo. I'm not sightseeing. I have business here. We have no choice but to stay here. We don't get to go back inside your atmospheric barriers at the end of the day. I don't live in the archaeology. Our children can't sleep at night because they can't breathe this filth. But that's about to change. You look like you've got more than enough credits to buy breathers for our families. I get no problem buying breathers for kids. I don't want any trouble. Let me just give you the credits. It's good that you can see these. Now go back to your penthouse in the archaeology. He just insulted me. He didn't call me a scab or use a bunch of nonsense language at me. I can say that a plus. Uh, what's up here? Nothing's up here. That's how well unique. Oh, dude, don't! don't. Time for this. You're gonna let yourself on fire! Oh, seriously, that's a bad idea. That's... This is the way to the greenhouse. We're not going to the greenhouse. Like I said, we're wasting time here. I'm mostly looking around, so we don't have to make it too short. And you just made that like a permanent hazard to navigate. <laughs> should kill you just for that. The archaeology's through there. Uh, the mosque has another entrance into it. So we're gonna head we're gonna head down over to the apartment area first. And the mosque meet up with the restaurant building. We'll be back for the greenhouse later. And I'll pick up there.